Hello YouTube. Hi, my name is Mark and this is Nixon Motorsports. This channel is all about motorsports from racing to exotic cars and even simulators. Today's video, this is a, a little different video than uh, what we normally do, um, but I felt it was important to, uh, to send this to you. Um, Avon, the racing tire company itself, Unfortunately, has news it will cease to operate uh, by the end of 2023. So the news is just out there. Um, it's a big deal. Let's get into the video. I'll tell you about it. Hey, really quick uh, segue here before I get into uh, the, the topic of the video. I got to show you. Um, finally have the four post lift in our uh, home garage. So this is quite nice bend pack you know typical stuff this is a four post double wide so this allows us to uh, well as you can see stack two cars on top two in the bottom and so uh, find that pretty cool so <laughs> at this point uh, we have enough garage space for six cars which is good um, all the cars are under cover the bad we have that Lotus Emira ordered and we don't know when that's coming in yet but uh, I'll have to figure out where we're going to put seven cars. <laughs> All right, let's get back to the video. Yeah, so big news in uh, motorsports. Um, Avon Tire shutting down end of 2023. Um, I, I've had a handful of conversations with folks. It's a big, big deal. So let me talk about that a little bit. But first, I think it's important just to share a little bit of, a little bit of history. You know, there's a. Uh, um, you know a handful of very large tire companies in the world you know a lot of consolidation going on um, but avon tire been around for a long time uh, they are in the uk uh, they have about 350 uh, people working at their facility today in their heyday i think they had a, a thousand maybe maybe 1500 or more um you know individuals working for them um Cooper Tire owns Avon. Cooper acquired Avon Tire in 1997. And actually recently, last year, uh, about uh, just over a year ago, um, Goodyear Tire purchased Cooper. So Goodyear Tire owns Cooper. Cooper, of course, one of the brands is Avon. Okay, just for some history. Right, so Avon Tire, they produce pretty much the exclusive um, racing tire for historics. Uh, they do rally car, they do motorcycle, they have a lot of racing slicks that uh, are actually a very competitive tire. Um, but, but there is a lot of concern, of course, for the ability to continue to support historic racing series like the Monterey Classic and so on. Um, Avon's been uh, and is currently still the only uh, racing tire company out there that does that um, so that's a big deal so what are the options in front right we don't know so the one thing that I will say so with this announcement that went out it was simply uh, Avon will cease to operate end of 23 there was no line of sight no no direction expectations if you will uh, to the market and that and that includes the 80 plus dealers around the world they have no idea uh, what's yet to come um, i would say that's part of the problem here so as i see it there's really three uh, three choices or three options that may unfold in front of us the first um goodyear Co cooper but goodyear tire company um, could decide um, that they will take the molds, you know, the technology, maybe some of the experienced personnel and so on, but they'll continue to produce the, the Avon specialty tires uh, just with another brand. So, you know, maybe Goodyear, Cooper, whatever they choose. So that is one option. Uh, the second option is someone or a some people step in uh, and purchase the molds technology hire the employees um, and spin up a new racing tire manufacturer 
to continue to support these particular tires in the market. That's an option. And I do know in speaking to some of the dealers that, um, that uh, um, there have been some uh, conversations, uh, reach out to leadership at Goodyear um, to see if that is a possibility. The third, and, and more disturbingly, uh, but the third option would be Goodyear just exits the market completely. They don't feel any value. They, uh, they archive the molds, destroy them, whatever, uh, and, uh, and, and that's it. So those are the three options that I can, I can think of. Yeah, so fun times. Huh? So what am I going to do? Um, and then I have a request for each of you as well. So uh, for my end, I'm going to reach out to leadership at Goodyear. Um, and I'm going to do that just as a, a courteous request. Um, if they can provide any direction, their position as to the possibility of continuation of the Avon um, tires themselves. Again, they could re be rebranded, whatever that is, but to see if we can get uh, any type of uh, response from Goodyear uh, on that. Secondly, I'll reach out to the leadership at Hoosier Tire. So Hoosier, as you know, is another racing tire company. Now, they're owned by Continental. Uh, they were acquired some years back. But uh, Hoosier, um, you know, builds a, a, a decent racing tire. I've used them myself years, pa years back. Um, the reason I'm going to reach out to, um, it's Rob, by the way, by the way, Rob Sims. I'm going to ask his thoughts on this. Um, are they in the position to either purchase the molds and such from Goodyear, uh, the Avon molds, or are they in the position or interest to possibly pick up and develop their own tire for these specialty markets? Purely a question, okay? Yeah, so uh, short video, but um, I wanted to get this out to you. So let me do this. Um, many of you are in racing. A lot of the subscribers um, to this channel are in motorsports in one fashion or another. So my ask of you would be to um, share news. Um, if you hear anything, um, please um, post comments. Um, questions, thoughts, um, anything along that line on this topic. Um, I think that would be, uh, that would be great. Um, and I will do the same. I'll produce another video here. Um, as soon as I have more detail, any type of response from Goodyear, Hoosier, Avon, um, anything that I can share that uh, helps us understand what's, what's, uh, what's going to happen, I'll, I'll do that. So hopefully uh, relatively soon. Hey, and I, I will have to ask, you know, please subscribe. If you haven't, um, please subscribe. I'm trying to get over the, uh, the thousand subscriber mark. Uh, and uh, I would sincerely appreciate that. That's it for today. Relatively short, unfortunate news. Hopefully we'll see uh, a positive outcome on this. Um, that's it for today. Until next time, okay? Ciao.